field trip to. What do you want for Christmas? So bitter. Hey y'all, it's Katie, and welcome to Vlogmas Day Three. So today it is December third, obviously, and I have school because I'm a normal child that goes to high school. Today's school day is a little different, and I'm so excited about it. I actually don't have to be in school today, which is amazing basically my film class was going on a field trip to tyler perry studios in downtown atlanta and if you don't know what that is it is a huge production studio company there's 32 people in my film class and everyone who wanted to go had their name submitted into a like a random generator and then he randomly generated 14 people if you were one of the 14 people that your name got chosen, you get to go so i got chosen that means i get to skip school today i still have to go to school because that's where the school bus is picking us up and taking us back but at least I don't have to be in all my classes. I'm excited though because getting a studio tour of like that famous of a tour. Also, they've never done a tour before this. So like we're the first ones to be able to get one. It's 7.30 in the morning right now. I leave at 7.45. All I need to do left is brush my hair, put on perfume and deodorant, and pack a small bag. The only thing about going into the studio is we had to sign an NDA, which is a non-disclosure order, saying that we cannot film or take pictures or video of anything in the studio during the tour. So that's why I don't know how long this vlog this is gonna be. I know it'll definitely be interesting because we're gonna be taking the bus and like going to eat and stuff. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 3. There's only 22 more days until Christmas. If you're new here, definitely subscribe and you can keep up with all the rest of the Vlogmases in the Vlogmas 2019 playlist on this channel. Follow all my socials. And with that being said, let's go to school. Look at the poopy. I'm at school now in Bella's car. Jamie and Avery are playing with Thomas's dog. He just got a new tiny little chocolate lab and brought it to school. And he brought it to school yesterday, so I already saw it. I did my mascara and eyebrows in the car. That's what I normally do because that's the only makeup I wear for school. And I don't have time to be doing that every day. Oh, we're vlogging. Ew, you got my double chin angles. You need to tell them what's happening this week. Oh, are you serious? Oh. Guys, I turned 16 this week. Woo! I think I'm the only one excited. <laughs> I don't. I have so much to do. I've I'm literally like, been hyping you up all week, and every time you're just like, yeah. Be day. <laughs> Look, I painted all my nails besides the one that's I disgusting. got them done. I Look how sad. I still haven't gotten mine done. Aren't they so sad? I painted them myself. Why I can't you tell you. Black? I had to. Painted my own for nails. comp. Why are you trying to show them aqua for? It's the, it's a, it's a, that most Grayson, get yeah. off. I shared a chapstick with a, everyone at the last football game, and I have with me. never had more chapstick lips in my <laughs> Hey, guys. Hi, it is Sam. Sam. I'm back here. What are you doing? I would much rather have a How's your day? What do you want for Christmas? A hot dog. <laughs> I'll be the really tall elf. Right, you got it. it is a solid 8.35 and Katie leaves it? at 9. Roxy. I love that you know that. Roxy. We're on the bus now. We're going to the studio tour. There's only 15 of us total. And there's only three total girls. And it's an hour and 15 minutes to get there. We made it to the studio. We're waiting in line to get in. There's like a little entrance. It's really pretty though. Like there's a fountain and a lot of green space. Supposedly this is like the nicest, the biggest film studio ever. So many people. We just got done with the tour at the Tyler Perry Studios and it was so cool. We learned so much and our tour guide, Jessica, was amazing. She so was nice. so nice. We love her the most. Thank you, Jessica. <laughs> we are going to a place called Pascal's now to go eat lunch. I looked at the menu and it's a whole lot of seafood. I hate seafood, but it's okay. We're gonna see what we like. The tour was so fun though. We could only record on the outside of the building, which is what I showed you guys, showing like the entrance and the wall with the pictures, but. <laughs> We're at the restaurant now. This is what it looks like. Fancy. Vlogmas. What's up, Vlogmas? <laughs> Got my 16 ounce ribeye steak from whatever this restaurant's called, and it's really good. <laughs> There's my salad. I'm off the bus now and we are back. We just got to the school and then I walked over to Zaxby's. And if you don't know what Zaxby's is, it is basically just like a fast food restaurant from Georgia. I don't know if they have it anywhere else. It's currently 3.10, school gets out at 3.30 and I'm meeting my brother here at 3.30. So once he gets out, he's gonna come here and then go home. So the trip was super fun. I didn't have that many friends go on the trip, but I enjoyed it with the people that I had.
have and I learned a lot about the film industry and the studio and all this stuff. You probably don't care about it if you're not interested in that type of stuff. My dad ended up showing up to Zaxby's and sat inside with me and we waited for Chase and now we're here and we didn't get Zaxby's. We're in the gas station and if you watch my vlogs you probably recognize this and Aurora is our best friend that works at the gas station and she's not here. She hasn't been here for two weeks. She's been on vacation. I'm getting my daily crack. We're gonna get some fun ones. This is my go-to. Hello. How are you? Is Aurora still not back? No, she went off. I know it might seem like I'm wearing this hoodie a lot, but it is December 2nd when I'm filming this. My dad brought home some packages from my P.O. box, and I decided to put a little unboxing in this vlog. So this is going in Vlogmas December 3rd, which is Vlogmas Day 3, but I'm filming it today on the 2nd, and that's why I'm wearing the same shirt, sweatshirt, as I was last time. Um, I know what one of these is. I don't know what the other two are. So this says, Hey Tough Cookie, and I don't know what this is from. really have no idea what it is, but it says, I'm a compostable male which is so good she your text oh, this is what I got for my mom so this company reached out to me and they make pantyhose and they want us to send me a pair but I don't wear pantyhose never have I don't think that fits my style or I like that much and I don't think I would use them but my mom wears pantyhose all the time because she's a businesswoman so I emailed them back and I was like yeah I would love to get these and how I was like I'm gonna give them to my mom came in that's so fun I'm definitely gonna give these to her today stretch me pull me stop me just try to break me believe the impossible our sheer knit is unbreakably in human hands tell us what you think <laughs> so this is i guess what all of their like pantyhose are made out of i really can't break it this is actually true so i guess this is a tester just to try and see if you can actually break it but i really can't oh my goodness this is really hard that's really fun and that's a cool way to be able to like test it out if you want to thank you so much to sheer text for sending these this is what i got her i'll show you what it is this is the classic black sheer text pantyhose and this is in a size medium for her they also sent over some really fun stickers which i will definitely be using they sent a note that says, hey, Katie, enjoy your Shears love team Shear tech. So that's super fun. Thank you guys for sending these over. This was sent to my PO box and I'm pretty sure this is from a subscriber. It says Carlissy. I think it's Carlissy Wills. If you guys don't know, I do have a PO box and all the information for it is down below. Everything that you send me, I read. And if you draw fan art, I keep it up on my wall. It's really fun and I love getting it. So let's see what they said. It's this little thing and I think they sent me some jewelry. Hey, Katie, here's a couple pieces of jewelry I thought you would like. Last time I sent you the necklace and you posted a clip about it and I got tons of orders and it really helped so if you like it would be awesome to include the necklace in your video you can also share a 10% off coupon called kd10 for your followers to use and my instagram is at beads with a z dot by dot kw thanks again so yes i actually do know what this was too she dm me on instagram a little while ago and said that she was sending me more jewelry i mentioned her jewelry in a main channel video before and apparently you guys spammed her with orders which is so cool and i love supporting small businesses i'll have her instagram on the screen and she sent me this really really pretty choker necklace i don't know if you guys can see but it has these three little like rocks or stones in the middle and then white beading and this adorable little cute bracelet she makes really cute really affordable jewelry so definitely go check her out if you want to place an order that is so cute okay i'm definitely gonna be wearing this thank you for sending this to me i hope i pronounce your name right carlissy so sweet i will always support small business owners we love the next package is probably what i'm most excited for because i know what it is lush reached out to me via email and they wanted to send me a package of their christmas stuff for a vlogmas this is not sponsored by the way but today wanted to send me PR and I'm so hype about it they wanted me to go shopping in the perimeter mall and go to their store and get stuff for free for Black Friday but I wasn't able to because I'm out of town but they sent over this huge PR package I've only ever tried two things from Lush and that is their like green face mask the crumbly peely one and their lip scrub so I am so excited about this I have no idea what to expect at all I also don't know which way to open it <laughs> ah, I'm so excited why would Lush want to send me stuff like what it already smells so good and only one little thing's open. Holiday season here, meaning tis the season for gift guides and vlogmas. We want to invite you and your followers to explore the magic of an ethical Christmas where low waste gifts, plastic free glitter, and 100% vegan goodness thrive to soothe, lather you and your holiday spirit while keeping you nice and cozy for the winter. But in here, we have lots and lots of packing peanuts. I'm just gonna pull things out randomly. So the first thing that I see, Snow Fairy Shower Gel. Ooh! Mm! How to use. Get naked, hop in the shower, and lather it up. That smells so so good and it's so glittery what is this oh my goodness so this is their winter berry soap delight in a berry refreshing cranberry tangerine wash with scrubby raspberry seeds Ooh, we have something in a box oh that's so cute Ooh, that smells fruity snowman bath oil tablet bathe in wintry sunshine with this uplifting lemon scented <gasps> 
Rudolph Bath Bomb. Oh dear, cozy up this sweet marzipan scented soak brimming with, with skin softening cocoa butter. I want to eat it all. It smells so good. Cookie dough! Cookie dough shower scrub, a sweet scrubber that smells good enough to eat. Maybe I will eat it. <laughs> it looks like cookie dough. Mm, polar bear plunge bubble bar. Oh, oh, this is fresh. Look at that little polar bear dude. Okay, dive into bear hug of refreshing peppermint in a frothy white blanket of foam. That is gonna be so good for my baths. You know what? We're gonna make a mess. I don't know if it was worth doing that. <laughs> Thank you so, so much, Lush, for sending over these products. I'm going to use all of them and rave about them. I also need to clean up the hundreds and hundreds of packaging peanuts on my floor now. I just want to thank all the companies that send me stuff all the time. I am so excited to test these out. All right, that's it for this little unboxing. Let's get back to the regular Vlogmas. <laughs> well, y'all, that is it for today's Vlogmas. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. I know this one was a little wild and wacky because I didn't have a normal school day, but it was super fun. Again, Exploring Tyler Perry Studios was amazing, and I just had a really good day overall. Tomorrow, we have a late start Wednesday, which we have the first of every single month where we don't have to be at school till 1020. If you enjoyed today's Vlogmas, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. You can follow all my social medias both on the screen and link down below, and don't forget to keep up with Vlogmas by watching the Vlogmas 2019 playlist. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace in the Middle East.